question. You guys talk about being on the scout, but you guys are really on the scout. Um. Yeah, you know, this game, you know, after last game and that poor start, it was very uncharacteristic of us, especially after this run we've had. You know, we felt like we went to Dayton and we gave a good fight. You know, got a, got a little out of hand at the end, but we thought that we really fought hard that game. Um, you know, the George Mason game, we really looked ourselves in the mirror and kind of said, you know, we got out-hustled, and that should never happen with a group like us. That's been our kind of our... Our motto uh, in conferences: We're going to out tough these guys. We're going to make the scrappy plays. We're going to be, you know, the dogs. We're going to be the, you know, aggressive team. And uh, they were that game. So that really kind of it was a gut check kind of moment for us to start this game. We were really fired up. We, you know, we were texting about it last night. We've talked about it all day today. How we were going to go out there and set the tone. We weren't going to let them punch us in the mouth. We were going to punch them in the mouth. And uh, I thought we did a really good job of that. Jay, can you describe maybe the the game from 10 minutes of the second half to about four minutes of the second half where they went on their run? You guys kind of had a hard time maybe crossing half court for a little bit, but obviously you stopped the bleeding and got a, a double-digit win. I mean, what was it like there when they're putting on a frantic comeback? I feel like I've been asked that question a couple times this conference season. Um, I mean, and and when I've been asked that, it kind of it's the same answer. It's we have practice with that. It's not necessarily good, but you know, later down the road in the conference tournament, maybe we're going to have the same thing, and we need to figure out. You know, we're a relatively young team, and we're going to need to figure out how to you know grit out some wins. Basketball is a game of runs, and uh, you know they made their run. We had our run earlier in the game, and we kind of sustained that lead. I was really proud of these guys. You know, they're they're a team that's built off kind of momentum. Uh, when things are going great for them, you know, it's really going great for them. They're benched into it. When things aren't, they're you know they're kind of you know they're quieter in a sense, and. Um, I thought we did a really good, really good job of gathering each other, huddling up, saying, let's keep our composure, let's be calm. And, you know, Quan and Dre made clutch foul shot after clutch foul shot. So, I mean, those guys, I couldn't be more proud of them. Quan, as a, uh, as a ball handler, when those guys are coming at you, full court press, I mean, what's it like in that scenario? And, I mean, like, like TJ just said, you and, and Sean Dre making, uh, you know, sealing that win there. I mean, what, what, what was it like to be a part of that? Um, I mean, it's, it's, a, it's tough at times when, when – uh, when you when you make it tough, uh, I was just uh, for a few minutes, few moments, I was I was thinking too much instead of just going in. Uh, that's what I'm best at, and I was a little too stagnant. But uh, I just fought through it and just uh, just huddled up. Uh, my teammates kept me up. TJ, Dre, Buck, Ju, Nick, we all stayed together on that. Well, could you say a word or two about TJ was referring to, which is just being aggressive from the start, not letting people. Take it to you. What happened that day and what happened against George Mason? Oh uh, yeah, um, we all know we're we're at our our best when we we would come out and punch them in the mouth. Uh, we make the first hit and just aggressive from the start so they don't uh, take advantage of that. It's all a mindset. Nick, uh, first start in a while. Feel different? Um, not necessarily. I think anytime you're playing a college basketball game, you have to be prepared whether you're starting or coming off the bench. So. I tried to have the same mindset that I uh, had been playing with uh, when I was coming off the bench, and um, I didn't try to. I didn't blink when I when I was told I was going to start. I just tried to come out there and help my team as best I could. Could you say a word about the first half defense? I thought we, you know, we brought a lot of intensity and we scored 18 points, and I think that you know we were really focused in on uh, what we had to do. Everybody was locked in on the scouting report, and even though we didn't necessarily shoot as well as we we can, uh, anytime we can rely on our defense to win a game, it's, it's always great. TJ, TJ, that difference, the defensive difference, 49 points in the first half against George Mason, which Sean Dre last week said that was unacceptable. Today it's only 18 in the first half. I mean, what does that tell you about your team that you guys can kind of flip the switch the right way, you know, in a span of just, just four days? No, uh, it shows a lot about our character. Um, you know, with Nick kind of getting in and, and uh, starting his first collegiate start, I thought he did a really good job. I thought, I thought really the defensive play that set the tone for us was they ran a ball screen and made a really nice pass to Hassan Martin, um, you know, a really athletic player. He could have easily, you know, he's going up to lay it up. He could have dunked it. And Nick came out of nowhere and blocked it. And it's just like, what, you know what I mean? The, that play set the tone for us defensively. We, uh, we knew that they were going to try to start the game high-low and try to bully us a little bit. And their first high-low pass, you know, I got up, I deflected it. So it was, it was being on their scout because once you take away kind of their bread and butter play that they think they're going to go to, you know, they start to second-guess themselves. And uh, in the first half, our, our defense, it was just so locked in, you know. Now, granted, we are in front of our bench. That does help a little bit. But I thought that everybody was just so keyed in on their man and on the scouting report. And... Uh, and that, I mean, that's the result we get.